Tuwa Koros Kiprono William anachulikana kama Rakita. Na um, uh, tunarudisha asante na shukran kubwa kwa serikali ya Kenya. Uh, sababu iliweza kutumana maafisa kutoka National Land Commission ika tutembelea kwa ground sisi tutukiwa uh, being the, uh, mimi nikiwa secretary general na jamani wangu na timu wa council shukuli ilikuwa ni ku, ku, kuangalia register zenye tulikuwa tumesipeana kama ni sawa kila mtu anakakuwa register yake na kwa wale tuliweza kukutana huko kwa ground waliangalia wakaona majina yao ni mazuri na ninashukuru shukrani sana serikali kupitia wa maafisa wa National Land Commission sababu ha aliweza kutuwapewa nafasi kuendelea kukakuwa hizo ma registers na tunapoendelea kukakuwa tunatarajia kwenda kwa maombi wa pale pe tunaombea ancestral shrines ya kusumek tunatarajia hiyo tarehe tisa mwezi wa tisa 2023 na hapo tutaendelea kukakuwa registers alafu baadaye tukisha kuwa tumeritika tunabeana kwa serikali kwa minajili ya kuwarudisha sisi kwa mashamba yetu sababu zetu za mao katika eneo le ina, 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 inajulikana kama cassette number 890 891 followed by legal notice number 148 enye ili actually ilikubaliwa na Kenya cassette notice ya NLC number 1995 first may 2019 na government of Kenya tax force 2018 ambaye ilikuwa inaongozwa na minister wa environment wa Kenya asante Dr Stephen Kibetkoske one of the leaders of Silivet Progressive Group which is part of Akek Akek Council of Elders Um, I only have two things to say. First of all, Okeke has suffered a great brutal suffering with the white colonial second by post regime government. The reason why I'm saying is that uh, like now these people from Silibwet Progressive Group are claiming 5000 negas which a white known as Dr. Dixon Strange ways came and the british government rewarded our ancestral land because he was a military person after retirement he came and he took over the land which uh, which we are claiming directly after that we had some visitors who came and they were given no support of the land despite the fact of our existence we were brutally evicted um in an, in, in summary let me say that we are requesting the government to take us back and not only taking us back we have the documents that shows that there is nobody there is no claimants apart from us we thank the government because the uh, ministry of lands has already uh, re written a letter to the ministry of forestry to give any document that actually prove whether they are there whether they they were their land of which they deviated to proof um we also thank the government because of the national land commission visits which they met us at Chuoche Bukin and uh, the way they were doing their things give us a lot of hope of which we know we are soon getting our rights going back to the land because we respect ecosystem we respect environment and we respect what is required i think that is with the caveat let me thank first of all the president when he was in akuru he gave out instruction for kavya to be lifted which is actually very true and at the same time he mentioned about resettlement which is coinciding directly with the what national lands commission has done ni <laughs> Wana yuto so ne yut yuto ne yut go ba ba ga go le ba le ba go ba ga sa ba le ba ba en ke be ni ba le ba ba den ba ba en ka san ba le ba ba le ba ta tu ma ki bo ki ngwa en ki go le ki